can't see me. Let's go. What up, what, what, what up, y'all? You can't see me here today back again. You already know what it is. Today, I'm looking at a new fishing title, Early Access. Um, it's actually not even on Steam yet. It's called Russian Fishing 4. And it's an alternative to planet fishing. If you're into fishing simulators, uh, there's an ultimate fishing simulator that's about to drop that I really want to play. This one here looks to be the competition and possibly the eliminator of planet fishing now planet fishing isn't a bad game i don't want to talk much about it but it basically is a pay to play game it started out as a great game and it's very fun very deep uh but they've become so greedy uh that it's ruined the experience for a lot of people so russian fishing 4 is the new alternative and for what it looks like even as it's just starting and it's very early access it seems to be a really great game so so i'm going to go ahead and do this registration process and then we'll cut to the game Look after your rod. A worn out tackle may fail at the most unexpected moment. Okay, so you gotta keep up your rod. Looks like your rod, your tackle, your uh, bait, things of that nature, they will wear out. So, okay. We suggest that you become familiar with the basic mechanics of the game. Are you ready for the tutorial? Yes. Approach the bank and stand on the bridge. Use the WSAD to move. During the dark hours, you can use the flashlight by pressing F. All right. Oh, nice. I hope it becomes controller compatible. Ooh, it's controller compatible. I'm going to use the keys right now, but I'm going to use my control eventually. Now, it looks good. This is a really graphically pleasing game so far i like the look of everything i had some old tires the gazebo gazebo cottage pine that's the cottage over there okay so we're gonna go on and do what the tutorial says for now this spot is perfect for fishing now let's choose a ride and set up the float rig with a fixed line first open the backpack by pressing i Trying to see my flashlight. All right, let's press I. Click icon named Telestick TL16 in the pop-up list. Then select fixed float rig, equipping fishing line, float hook, and bait. Then take the rod into your hands by clicking the pickup button. Wow, it's a lot to this. So you got a map of the cottage pond. So this is the Telestick TL16. Okay, line, float, hook, bait. Okay, so we got the line. Okay, it has the weight, does it glow, the hook, uh, 16 and 14. We'll go with the first one. Mm. We'll start with the worm. Fishing with a sandwich bait ability is required. Okay, we're not there yet. All right, and let's pick it up. Nice. The tackle is almost ready for fishing. Set the one meter depth. That will help the bait get closer to the bottom. Okay, so you can set the depth. To set the float depth, use the plus minus keys. Okay, so let's do that. Okay, it's at 19 centimeters, 21 centimeters. One meter. So the tackle is ready for casting. Try to cast. Consider the wind speed and direction. Aim at the center of the glowing circle. This is the area where the float must get to. Cast the line by pressing the left mouse button. The longer you hold the left mouse button, the more force is applied. Control the casting force using the pop-up indicator. The cast is done when you release the left mouse button. Okay, 
So I did 70%. Ah, 70% was perfect. Zoom in helps it follow the float easier. So press Z. Ah. Wait for the bite. Watch the float carefully. If it sinks or moves aside, set the hook and pull the fish closer to you. To do that, press and hold the left mouse button. If you set the hook successfully, you will feel the load on the ride. Okay. So it's bobbing, but I ain't seen it really, really move like this. It's bobbing. They, they tugging at it. They tugging at it. I'm trying to wait on a real strong one. It hasn't sank yet. Oh, it's moving. It's moving. It looks like they got it. Oh, I got me a fish. I got me a fish. Sweet. Ugh. New achievement. Simple and reliable. Good start. Congratulations. You have caught a fish and earned some experience. Place the fish into the keep net by clicking keep button in the lower part of the appeared window. Okay, so I got one bonus luck. 21 XP. Float fishing up two percent so keep the space or backspace to release so we're gonna keep this this is our first fish we keeping that now let's go to mosquito lake and try to sell our catch at the fish market to move to the other location open control panel by clicking escape then click the bar with the depiction of the current location in the pop-up window alrighty Uh, look at your boy right here, level one. So it's a lot going on. You got messages, inventory, keep net skills, feed, crafting, statistics, records, rating, log book. Okay. Premium, not active. So I ain't premium. So you can't pay and spend money in this game, but I'm a free player. I don't believe in uh spending money like that. I'll, I'll pay for the game initially, but you know what I mean? But that's okay. That's it. So moving to Mosquito Lake. Find a bar with an image of the desired location in the lower section of the screen and click it. Then click the button travel in the central part of the screen. Okay, so Mosquito Lake. Ah, uh, look at Mosquito Lake. Let's hit travel. Use the nighttime to your benefit. Some fish species feed at night. They are less cautious and move close to the shore. All right. Welcome to Mosquito Lake. Find the fish market and sell your catch. You are earning almost nothing now. In the future, try to catch big fish. The price is much higher. Okay, so there's the fish market. You have found a fish market. Sell your catch. Find a bar with a picture of the caught fish in the pop-up list. Then click the sell button. Okay. So you get six for that. Nice. You earn your first money in the game. Congratulations. Now close the fish market window. We have one more task. Okay. All right, find the tackle store and buy worms. Click the WASD to move in the dark hours. You can use the flashlight, okay. So that's the grocery store. Okay, that's the boat station. That looks kind of tackly. No. Cafe. Tackle store, okay. Field kitchen workshop. Go to the directory baits and click the bar name worm in the list that appears. Purchase worm by clicking the buttons with the depiction of coins. That's a lot of rides. Okay, so baits. Worms. Let's 
and Nightcrawlers, leeches. Oh, so I see it's gold money, and then you got the silver money. So the silver probably the more basic. The gold, you'll probably get more hits, but it also costs more. I see how y'all doing. You got to spend some real money, probably. So let's go with another worm. Okay, here's the depiction of the money. You have purchased worms. This is a universal bait that will help you in the beginning. So close the store now, okay. You have fulfilled all our tasks successfully. Keep striving forward. Start exploring the world of Russian fishing yourself. You can learn more about control functions in the quick help window. To view the quick reference, click F1. Enjoy the game. All right. So it looks like you have an energy meter, you have a food meter. Not sure what that one at the bottom is. Oh, okay. So you can eat at the field kitchen. I think you can eat there. What's the workshop? Yeah, you can repair your rod. Okay. Cafe. Alright, so at some point I'm gonna explore this whole area. Really see what's around and see if a bear jump out at you or something. Got the full moon up there. Ooh, a boat. I'm gonna fish right here. Hey, let's get on the boat. Oh, buy a ticket for the boat at the boat station. Oh, okay. I wonder can you fall off? Valdor Common Roach. All right, how do I get my ride back out? I wonder if it's a quick way to pick up. Zoom. Use my flashlight. Let's see if we get any hits, y'all. Catch our first fish at this lake as well, at Mosquito Lake. So, yeah, it looks like this game is very realistic. Very realistic. Valdor Common Roach. What does that mean? So, I'm going to go back to the first lake. So, we'll go back to the first spot, Cottage Pine. See if we have more luck there. Now, I explore a little bit. Okay. Go over here to the cottage since this is cottage. Oh, get spare tackle. Okay. Succeeded. The greenhouse. Oh, it's a workbench for crafting. Oh, nice. Okay, free tackle is available once a day. Oh, you get recipes for crafting. Oh, nice. That's interesting. So I wonder what you can craft. Okay, I'm going to try to control it real quick just to see how it uh, operates. Okay. Uh, it looks like it's not fully compatible yet because I can't turn left and right. I can use the stick to move, but then I have to use the mouse to look around. Can't run. So it's not mapped yet for the controller. Let's 
start select. Yeah, nothing works. Okay. Like I said, it's not getting the same type of activity we were getting in the tutorial. So I'm wondering if <laughs> just because it was a tutorial, you know, they let you catch that first fish. Oh wow, this one is uh, a little more serious. This one fighting. How do I know when it's too much pressure? Oh. I'm gonna let him run. Oh, he ran it. He ran it. He ran it. Oh, we got a serious one. We got an active one. Come on. Come on. Trying to rock him to sleep. Trying to wear him out. Ah, yeah. Woo. Personal biggest, personal record. Floating fish. Oh, that's a big purse right there. 61. Yeah, we gonna keep him. Okay, getting some action. So as soon as it go under, I'm gonna press both mouse buttons and see what happens. They ain't lifting up. There we go. There we go. Oh, I'm gonna have to go sell these fish too. Just see if we can keep this party going. I wanted it over a little more towards the uh, the brush, but it's all good. Then I go sell these fish. Up, oh, getting some activity. Oh snap. Oh snap. Oh a Chinese sleeper. Let me check my uh keep net. One minute, one minute, two minutes, twelve minutes. I'm liking Russian fishing for. You can chill out, relax. Fishing keeps you calm. I could have sent this guy back. These guys give me some decent personal record, most expensive fish. Well, I'm gonna keep beating that record. Nice. All right, so I'm gonna take a little break. But that is Russian Fishing 4. Really enjoying this game. Great alternative to fishing planet. So check it out. You can't see me. You know what you must do above all things. Make your next move your best move, all right? Peace. You can't see me. Let's go. Thank you for checking me out at You Can't See Me TV. I'm You Can't See Me Gamer. Please like and subscribe to stay updated and check me out on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. All right, peace.